So, yeah, strangely enough, Congress itself has actually been doing the right thing on this. Tell us about Congress. Which is not a phrase I say often, but they've actually been doing... they, 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 both House and Senate, which are both Republican run, same party as the president, have put forward their own kind of funding bills for NASA next year as part of this whole ongoing annual process. So something called the president's budget request. So the, the budget, the president requests, here's what I want to spend next year uh, for NASA. So with all this in mind, Casey, so the president's budget <laughs> request this year was extraordinarily low. Destructive, yeah. So Conian, unstrategic, wasteful. There's yeah. a deeper level of animosity clearly being expressed yes. towards federal investment in science Correct. that I think is profoundly short-sighted. Right. and ignores the wild benefits that have come from, again, this very brief, in one person's lifetime, the United States went from not funding science barely at all to having, you know, winning most Nobel Prizes in science, right? The so okay. let, me, let me just make a public service announcement, if I might, <laughs> because what you're saying right now seems to be that if you can incentivize the, your representative mm -hmm. to fund NASA... NASA will be funded. And believe it or not, when you reach out to the people that you vote for and tell them, hey, man, you better do this, mm -hmm. they actually do take note mm -hmm. because quiet as it's kept, we're the boss. <laughs>